This memorial was built to mark the public affection for Sir Jimmy Savile, DJ and charity worker. Its removal last night reflects the public disgust for the man the police say was a serial sex offender. Savile's family say their decision was a mark of respect for others buried at this Scarborough cemetery. Well, I've been a law unto myself all my life and now I'm legal. Growing numbers of women are coming forward to paint a dark picture of his life. Police think he may have abused as many as 30 teenage girls over four decades. Detectives are investigating events at locations across the country. At BBC sites in London, a children's home in Jersey, an approved school in Staines, Stoke Mandeville Hospital and Leeds General Infirmary where Jimmy Savile was involved in charity work. Good evening. Welcome. If he was still alive, he would be under arrest. But even though Jimmy Savile can never now face charges, police say they want to hear from any other women who believe they too were abused by him. They want to establish the extent of the allegations and to see who else might have been involved. James Kelly, BBC News.